know that each of these objects you see can be used for an entire home workout, and that's including the wall behind Jess. This is our ottoman workout. So Jess is gonna take us through three different exercises you can do with an ottoman of whatever size you've got. We're gonna start with a curtsy step down off of the ottoman. So we want a nice stable foot, posture is lined up, and we wanna have control all the way up and down going through the motion. And a way to make sure our knee stays really safe is to think about rotating our hips toward that front knee. So the torso should stay all lined up together and we're just getting this rotation at the hip, which is gonna give us a really big stretch and squeeze onto the outside glute. So it looks like Jess has a bit of a tougher time rotating on this side. So we're gonna see if she can rotate her hips toward that front knee a bit more. Yeah, so it might mean that side of the hip is a little tight for her, but this is a great way to train those imbalances, those challenges, all in the comfort of your home. Nice job. So our second exercise is gonna be a little bit more core. So we're gonna go into mountain climbers with a rotation to a side plank. So Jess is really strong with her hands, making sure her shoulders are stable and packed. And she's making sure to keep her core tight and hips pulled a little bit forward so they support her and keep her in a nice aligned position as she rotates from center to side. So she's getting the heart rate up by moving fast through those mountain climbers and she slows it down to stack her shoulders, stack her hips and control the rotation. Also really helps to think about squeezing your shoulder blade back as you get in that side plank, it'll make sure your shoulders get stacked and it'll help open up the chest. Nice control. Our last exercise is gonna be a leg and glute finisher. So she's gonna go with a straight leg hamstring bridge with a leg lift. So with both legs straight on the ottoman, she's gonna hinge at the hips to lift up, core is staying really tight. And then we're gonna pick up one leg and lift. So she's holding tension in her left leg, all in that hamstring, all in that glute, all in the core. And she's careful not to let the hips rotate or drop. Also careful not to let the core go so that the back arches. We need to keep that core tight so we have lots of strength. So now she has to hold all her tension in the right leg. Looks a little harder to keep that side steady, but she's doing all right. She's keeping that left hip forward, not letting it drop having really good control with that leg lift. Always think about steady breathing, make sure you can make it all the way to the end of the workout and then control it to come back down. Yay! You did it! Thanks for watching our home equipment workout video. Make sure to like this video, share it with everyone, subscribe so you never miss a video, comment and we'll be happy to reply, add us on social because we're everywhere and you're gonna wanna see us everywhere. So thank you so much for watching. We love you all, stay safe and we'll see you next time.